Say hey guys. It's me and Shar Shar. We're just sitting here waiting. I know. The waiting game for sure now. I'm not really pushing her too hard because daddy's not home yet, so I'm just trying to be super quiet and get her to kind of just relax. She'll lay for a minute, then she gets up. Then she lays for a minute, then she gets up. Then she nests. Okay, now she's nesting. Apparently she wants to have the babies on top of the rainbow pillow. Is that a good spot? Okay, so this is what we're going through. The temperature has dropped, but as you can see, she's not really panting like that labor pant that you usually see constantly right before they deliver. So we kind of haven't got to that stage yet, but if I remember correctly, I don't think Charlotte pants a ton before. So, you know, we could have an hour, we could have six hours, we could have 12 hours. I'm just not sure. But definitely, as you can see, she's nesting, temps dropped. We're, we're almost there. She keeps getting up like she's having pain. She keeps jumping. So I think we're, the, you know, the cervix is starting to dilate a little bit. So that small contractions begin, but not contractions to where they push just contractions to where it begins to dilate their cervix so they can get ready for a pushing time. And that can take a few hours as well. So I do think they'll deliver tonight. It could be middle of the night still, early tomorrow morning type deal. That's what I'm thinking. Last time she went at 9.30 p.m. We could be on the same kind of track for that, which would be better than the middle of the night. But we are ready. Um, we got the little studio set up going on. Ella's, uh, I actually brought down her whole desktop. <laughs> the whole thing's back here because I didn't want to bring Joey's laptop because he has homework. And then here we have the pad set up now, ready to go. I brought the supplies right here. Everything right there is I need, the washcloths. I kind of moved the bassinets out of the way so we could have more room to get, like if someone's helping me, they can get to the sides easily. Um, Trash bags are set up, ready to go for pads, more pads, wipes. I think we're good. So I got the heating pads on already, just in case. So they're nice and warm. Now it's just the waiting game. So I'm gonna post this video. You guys, uh, let me know if you get notifications or not. Hopefully you do, but like I said, if you haven't followed the steps, to get them is something probably with your phone or something, because you should get them. So there's a lot of different menus and places you go to make sure you get notifications and each phone is different. So I can't really go through every phone. I just kind of did my phone because I have an iPhone, but different phones are different. Um, you're not gonna get a notification if you did not use a Google and set up an account on YouTube, like set up your own YouTube account. You're not gonna get notifications if you don't have that account set up. And you're not subscribed anyways if you don't have that, that account set up. So um, please make sure if you wanna see the live birth that you subscribe to the channel so you can get notified when we come on. And um, I could make a setting I think to where we can just do our subscribers. So I potentially may do that as well. So I don't know if I'll make it private or public. I haven't really decided yet. So just make sure because I don't want a lot of like bots and like randoms, you know what I mean? Like we've gotten in the past. So just make sure if you want to join us that you are subscribed. We appreciate it. We love you guys. We need your support. We love you when you're with us. So please let, please, you know, be there with me because I'm super nervous. But I know Char's going to be fine. I love you, Char. All right. See you soon, guys. Bye.